The Republic of Zamboanga was a short-lived sovereign republic founded by General Vicente Álvarez with his Zamboangueño Revolutionary Forces after the Spanish government in Zamboanga officially surrendered and turned over Real Fuerza de Nuestra Señora La Virgen del Pilar de Zaragoza to Gen. Vicente Álvarez in May 1899. On 28 May 1899, Gen. Vicente Álvarez proclaimed independence and became the first and last genuinely elected president of the republic. History Establishment On February 28, 1899, in a house in Santa Maria, a revolutionary government was organized and General Vicente Álvarez was elected provisional president and commander-in-chief. He then planned to take Fort Pilar which was the last Spanish stronghold in the Philippines. End of Spanish rule the Republic was formally established on May 18, 1899, with the surrender of Fort Pilar to the revolutionary government of Zamboanga under the leadership of General Álvarez. On May 23, 1899, the Spaniards finally evacuated Zamboanga, after burning down most of the city's buildings in contempt of the Zamboangueños' revolt against them. American Occupation General Alvarez's term was cut short when the commander of Tatuan, Isidro Midal, cooperated with the Americans in exchange for the presidency with his cohort Datu Mandi. He then ordered the assassination of Major Melanio Calixto, acting commander of Zamboanga, because Alvarez was on a trip to Basilan to recruit more forces. On November 16, 1899, Midal flew the white flag over Fort Pilar to signal the occupying American forces to enter the fort which led to the overthrow of Alvarez's government. Alvarez and his allies were forced to flee to the nearby town of Mercedes then to the island of Basilan and went into hiding. In December 1899, Captain Pratt of the 23rd U.S. Infantry arrived at Zamboanga and took control of Fort Pilar. Thereafter, the nascent republic became a U.S. protectorate or puppet government and Midal as puppet leader of U.S. was allowed to continue as president of the republic for about 16 months. Decline and aftermath of the republic In March 1901, the Americans allowed the republic to hold elections and Mariano Arquiza was elected to succeed Midal as the new president of the Zamboanga Republic. However, Arquiza's government did not exercise effective authority over Zamboanga and finally in March 1903, the Republic of Zamboanga was dissolved. After, the American colonial government designated Zamboanga as capital of the newly established Moro province which served as the provincial entity of Mindanao with Brigadier General Leonard Wood as its governor. Legacy The Republic of Zamboanga during President Alvarez S. term claimed territorial rights over the islands of Mindanao, Basilan, and Sulu, encompassing all of the southern Philippines in the midst of war against the Spanish, Americans, and natives of those islands. However, the Republic's actual sovereignty extended only to the current boundaries of Zamboanga City. See also Zamboanga City List of historical unrecognized countries The monkeys have no tails in Zamboanga Notes External links Witawit. Net, The Republic of Zamboanga